Yes. How's it going? It's Jerry here with Any Level Fitness. Um, we're going to be doing more like leg workout today. A little upper body also. But uh, first thing we're going to do is a, you can grab both weights, but we're going to do a split stance. Um, just get a split stance. We're going to bend over at, uh, at the waist, if I can talk right. Then we're just going to do one arm backwards. So, you know, we actually just holding a neutral grip and then just, just pull it up and down, all right? So, all right. Everybody go ahead and get in position. One foot behind you. Back straight. Lean over. And go ahead and go. The weight that you have is kind of light. Do a fly. But weight's pretty good. You can stick with the back row. You do that fly. Make sure that elbow stays bent. You don't have it straight out and then do it. Keep that elbow nice and bent. Side, switch the sides. So right foot was forward, left foot forward, and go ahead and go. You can switch it up if you want. Do a couple back rows. A couple back flies. Make sure that core stays nice and tight. Don't let that lower part of your back round off. Okay, so don't, don't do this right here. Get that nice and straight. More more. Time. Put the weights down, go down on the floor when you plank up. So elbows to hands. So I'm here. Just push up and then switch sides. Go ahead and go. If you have to, drop down to your knees and do the same exact thing. Time. Scrum our dumbbells. Stand back up. Now we're going to do a straight leg deadlift to a curl. Feet shoulders apart. Knees soft. Go down. As you come back up, do the curl. Go ahead and go. Make sure that back stays nice and straight when you do this here. As we get over this, we're going back down on the floor, keeping the weights. Done. Everybody down on the floor. We're going to do a chest fly with the leg kick out. And go ahead and go. Remember, when that chest fly, your elbow stays slightly bent, okay? So you don't have to have the arms completely straight here. Kick that leg out as far as you can without that lower part of your back arching. Time to weights down, two plank ups. Roll over and go ahead and go when you're ready.
time. Everybody stand up. Gonna do a hammer curl, squat, press. Go ahead and go. Hammer curl, squat, press. Down on the floor, gonna do a side plank with the back row, and go ahead and go. Remember, try to keep your legs straight, and if you cannot do that, bring the knees up to your chest, do a kneeling side plank, and then do the back row. Almost there, keep going. Time, switch sides. And go. Fifteen seconds. Time. One last thing. Elbows and hands. And go ahead and go. If you have to, you can just hold a plank or a high plank. The only if you cannot do the elbows to hand. Done. Take a breather. Kiss on line. This is more of an upper body workout with a little bit of legs. But uh, all right, we're going back to the beginning, which is split stance. Um, deadlift with the one arm back row. All right, grab your weights, left foot forward, bend over, and do a one arm back row. Go ahead and go. Remember, we can do that one arm fly. Do the fly, it's a little bit harder in the core. Really keep that back nice and straight, core tight. Top, switch the socks. And go ahead and go when you're ready. Make sure we're not raising up and down. Here, okay? Make sure you stay right there. Your upper body stays um, in one spot. And it's all your arm that's moving. Tom. Down four, plank ups. And go ahead and go when you're ready. How about the hands?
10 seconds, keep going. Everybody up. Straight leg deadlift curl. And go ahead and go when you're ready. Make sure you feel that pull in the back of your legs when you do this one, okay? Fifteen seconds. Keep going. Time on the floor. Just fly the leg kick outs. And go ahead and go. Make this a little harder to kick both legs out at the same time. Just fly, kick them both out. Don't do that if your lower part of your back is arching real bad. Try not to let that lower part of your back arch at all. Time. Roll over, plank ups, and go ahead and go. Twenty seconds, keep going. Time. Everybody up. Gonna do the curl squat press. And go ahead and go when you're ready. Curl squat. Press. If you don't want to do the squat, that's fine. Make sure you just do the curl to press. But if you can, add that squat in there. Time. Gonna get into a high plank this time and then do a one arm back row. Just pull it up. Go ahead and go when you're ready. Same thing here. We can do a chest fly, I mean a back fly. Swing it up. Do the same thing on your knees. Anything we can do. I mean, everything that we do on the floor, on our hands, we do it on our knees too. As long as that back is straight, that core is tight. Top. All right, let's go ahead and switch sides. And go ahead and go. Plank ups, elbows to hands. And go ahead and go when you're ready. Halfway there, keep going. Remember, if you have to, just hold a plank. Time! Get our 
weights. Get to the wall. And let's hold a wall sit. Get to the wall. Get down into a squat and let's hold it. Time starts now. If you want to, we can add some curls in there. Remember, if you don't have a wall, we can just get down into a front squat and just hold that. So if you'd rather do it this way than on the wall, that's fine also. Just hold it right here. But do whatever you want to do. 20 seconds to go. Hold it. Five seconds. And time. Good job, everybody. Ah. Come back down the floor. And we're doing those elbows to hands, so plank ups. Everybody in position, go ahead and go. Ten seconds to go. Keep going. Almost there. Ta! Everybody up. Grab your weights. Going to do the curl, squat, press, and go ahead and go. Make sure we're doing this. We're not swinging the arms back, doing the curl and squat press, okay? Go down nice and easy, then come straight back up, okay? So, none of that. Down easy, back up. So, on the floor, chest flies, leg kick outs. And go ahead and go when you're ready. Do the two legs if you can. Both legs kicked out at the same time. Make it a little harder, keep the legs straight the whole time. Time. Rolling over, elbows to hands. And go ahead and go when you're ready. Fifteen seconds, almost there. Time, everybody up. Grab your weights. Let's do that straight leg deadlift bicep curl. And go ahead and go. Don't forget to push your hips back when you do this. Push your butt back, do a little pull in the back of your legs. Stand up, do the curl. 10 seconds. Time. 
Get that split stance, do that one arm back row. And go ahead and go, bend over. One arm back row. Or the back fly. Back fly takes a little bit more balance. Make sure that back heel is off the floor too when you do this, okay? Get that back heel off the floor and then do the move. Time. Put the weights down, let's go down the floor. Let's do those plank ups again. And go ahead and go. Twelve seconds, keep going. Done. Everybody up. Now we're going to the other side. So get the left foot forward, got the right foot forward. Bend over to that back row. Back row or the back fly. Ten seconds. Time. Put the weights down. Back on the floor. Go in those plank ups. And everybody up. Go ahead and go. Get her weight. Get into a side plank and let's do that one arm back row. Everybody up and go. Remember, try to do it with your feet straight out. If you have to, bring the knees up to your chest. Raise up. You do the same exact thing. Do the back row. Remember, when we're doing this, we're trying to get her. Elbow back, up and back. So we're trying to do like a back row when we do this, okay? Five seconds. Time, switch the sides. Everybody up. And go ahead and go. Fifteen seconds, keep going. Stop. Ah. We're going to alternate arms this time. Get both weights. Get into a push up stance. Do a renegade row. So one arm and then the other. have to, you can get down on your knees and do the same exact thing. Stop! Grab one of your weights, get to the wall and hold a wall sit. 
Hold the weight here at your chest. Everybody down. Time starts now. You want both the weights, you can grab both the weights and do the same exact thing. But we're going to hold them up right here. Try and get your legs parallel to the floor, the top of your thighs. Ten seconds. When I tell you to, as soon as the bell rings, we're going to get up. We're going to start doing goblet squats or jump squats. Time. Hold the weight here. And let's squat and do a little jump. Go ahead and go. You cannot do the jump. Just do the squats. But you can do the jump squats. Do the jump squats. Make sure you land nice and soft. If you have both weights, hold them up here. Hold the weights together. Do the same exact thing. Or hold them on your sides and do it. Time. Back to the wall. Back to this wall set. And go ahead and go. So we only to hold it right here at your chest. This is a little harder, or we just hold it right here at the sides. So, or just get rid of one. Hold it right here at your chest. Ten seconds. Time, everybody up. Do those jump squats. And go ahead and go. Walk, jump. Go. Time starts. You can do these nice, slow, and controlled, or you can just go quick as you can. Non stop jump squat. Back to the wall. Wall set. Everybody down. Time starts now. Ten seconds. Hold it. Get down to that squat. Sorry. Last set of these jump squats. And go. Twenty seconds. Keep going. Let's go. No breaks. Time. Everybody down on the floor. Let's do a plank up again. And everybody up. Go ahead and go. You cannot do this plank up. Remember, just hold a plank. Time. Big breather. Let's do it one more time. All right, go ahead and go. Plank up again.
12 seconds, keep going. Almost there. And top. Awesome, good job everybody. Got a foam roller, got to roll out or and roll your legs out, stretch your legs out, do some upper body stretches too. Other than that, have a good night and I'll see everyone Wednesday at 6.30. All right, bye.